Sometimes animals that have lived in the wild all their life will at some point, sometimes under very peculiar conditions, show up outside of it. And one of the places they show up is on the road. And when they do make their first road trip out into the world, we humans have an equally crazy chance of interacting with them. These are the most incredible experiences with animals on the road. Number 15. The French ambassador to Saudi Arabia shares a video of an unexpected encounter with monkeys. The French ambassador to Saudi Arabia was out and about on a spot of monkey business when he tweeted a video of an unexpected encounter with some baboons on the road. The high mountains of Saudi Arabia are home to some huge numbers of baboons. These animals are a frequent sight in a sea region of the country and can be often found doing random vehicle inspections along the mountain roads. Seriously though, these monkeys get most of their food from encounters with humans on the road. They've learned to search vehicles with extraordinary efficiency, and if they do spot a vehicle slowing down, they'll be on it within a matter of seconds, performing a search as extensive as border guards with a cocaine tip off. These baboons also mean business and will not take no for an answer but it appears that the French ambassador's vehicle didn't slow down sufficiently enough to be swamped with monkeys. Although the footage does capture the animals lining the roadside as if waiting for a Disneyland parade, it's a menacing sight, which if you switch just a little bit also kind of feels like Planet of the Apes. Number 14, terrifying moment tiger chases motor biker down road. These motorcyclists would narrowly avoid a big catastrophe, went out for a casual ride by the forest in India. Good grief, it's a heart-stopping anxious, few seconds of film. And you can only imagine how it must feel to be pursued by a tiger. These people though, they actually know how it feels. This incredible encounter would be filmed by the Forest Department officials near a wildlife sanctuary in India. And there are currently believed to be 72 Bengal tigers living in that area. An enormous Bengal tiger sprinting through the forest as the motorbike travels along the road would be filmed by the passenger on the back of the bike. And that's when the tiger suddenly leaps out with the trees and into the road immediately behind the motorcycle. Thundering along at enormous speeds, there's a chilling moment when it looks as though the tiger might catch up with the bike. As the tiger sprints closer, it suddenly then veers off again into the forest on the other side of the road. Tigers can actually run up to 40 miles per hour, which is as fast as some mopeds top speeds. No doubt, he was probably just showing that he could have gotten them. You know, if he wanted to. Number 13. Cyclists chased by an ostrich. Despite their comical appearance, a run-in with an ostrich is no laughing matter. The legendary Johnny Cash was even once attacked by one, and had it not been for his solid country belt buckle, he might have suffered more than the broken ribs and the gash to the stomach. These are some big bad birds. <laughs> So, when this group of cyclists in South Africa got an unexpected hangar on while they were riding to the Cape of Good Hope, it was fortunate that the ostrich seemed to be just out for a spot of exercise. Running alongside the cyclist, the ostrich makes a pretty funny sight. Just imagine being at the side of the road and watching this motley crew speed by. Although there does seem to be something a little reminiscent of Jurassic Park in this footage, considering that ostriches can reach top speeds of up to 42 miles per hour. The guy could probably catch up to and likely pass by these bicycles at any point. So, I guess perhaps he was just warming up. Cyclists often find themselves in encounters with animals on the road. It's sometimes dangerous, like when dogs run across the street during a bike race, or sometimes funny, like when a herd of cows wanders onto a mountain road and stops the Tour de France and its tracks. Number 12. Lion Pride Blocking Road in Kruger National Park. If you're a lion, well, you can pretty much lay down wherever you damn well feel like. I mean, who's going to argue with you? Kruger National Park in South Africa is home to many lions, and they're one of the reasons that so many people visit the park every year. Just hoping to catch a glimpse of these beautiful animals. So, to encounter a whole pride of them just lounging on the asphalt is a treat that no visitor would mind and would incur the traffic jam happily in order to witness. It looks as though these lions were just warming themselves in the afternoon, sun enjoying a little bit of a cat nap. When all of the vehicles begin turning up to have a look, 
The pride then begins to shift around a bit, perhaps slightly irritated with having their snooze interrupted. They slowly begin to get up and saunter off quite at their own pace though. Nobody really tells them what to do, do they? They aren't called kings of the jungle for nothing you know. This extraordinary encounter may have been nothing much for those lions except a minor irritation that sent them off in a search of a less busy sleeping spot. But for the people fortunate enough to be visiting Kruger that day, it was a once-in-a-lifetime moment of magic. Number 11. Driver Encounters Endangered Tiger in Siberia Just imagine driving along a deserted Siberian road. Everything's quiet and still. The snow-covered landscape bleak and endless. It's the same as any other day. Any other drive along this same old Russian road, but then suddenly as if you're in a dream or a hallucination up ahead. An incredible creature steps onto the road. Are your eyes deceiving you or perhaps it's simply an Amur tiger? One of the rarest and most endangered animals on earth standing right in front of you. It's utterly incredible. The driver must have felt a sense of awe as this extraordinary tiger stepped into view. There are fewer than 500 of these Siberian tigers left in the wild. So hardly any humans are able to set eyes on them, and they seem almost mythical. The few that do remain live in the far east of Russia, and some may also exist in China and North Korea. But that's it, nowhere else in the world. It's a remarkable sight in and of itself to see a massive wild big cat. But when you consider just how rare these animals actually are, then it becomes totally amazing to get this close to a tiger. And just how this driver managed to capture it all on film is amazing in itself. Number 10. Herd of deer tried to cross a road. One of them lands on a BMW. About 1 million road traffic accidents in the United States are caused by deer every year, which is kind of insane. Who's letting these animals drive anyways? Am I right? Captured on a dash cam? This crazy footage shows the terrifying moment when a whole herd of deer come hurtling out of the forest and into the path of oncoming traffic. Shot in Poland, these deer almost cause a pile up when they fail to look both ways before crossing the street. But unlike some incidents, it seems as though these guys have some pretty nifty evasive maneuvers in their skill set. Just look, there are a couple of deer that hurdle over the BMW in front without even breaking their stride. One of the herd, however, has a less elegant landing and wings up, sat on top of the BMW. A bit surprised by the whole event, he quickly thinks better of this road-crossing business and then hot-foots it back to the safety of the forest, looking to all intents and purposes like a group of free runners. These deer are actually very fortunate to get away with all of their numbers intact. Thousands of deer are killed on the roads annually, and collisions with deer cause 200 human deaths in the United States each year. It's basically the same all the world. These guys just keep on leaping in front of vehicles. They could really do with a crossing guard. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Now, it's time for the sweet topic. It's not often you encounter lions on the road, but that's not the case for 23-year-old amateur photographer, Carolyn Dunford, and she didn't see two lions. She witnessed them bringing down and savaging an antelope. Normally, such a thing would go down in the depths of the wild. But in this instance, it happened mere inches away from passenger-filled cars. Truly shocking and truly incredible. Thankfully, as an amateur photographer, Carolyn was able to snap the incredible moment for other people, including you and I to see. Nature and humanity happening mere inches away from each other. Comment down below with the hashtag sweet topic and let us know your opinion in relation to what we just showed on screen. And with that said, let's keep things moving. Number 9. Cheeky Elephant Stops Passing Trucks to Steal Bundles of Sugar Cane You got to love an animal with an initiative. This elephant has the swagger and the confidence of a traffic cop making a routine stop on a busy highway. Drivers on this road in Thailand have to contend with a nosy elephant with a penchant for stopping traffic and then rummaging through trailers. The big animal took his time wandering casually through the trucks, passing by the wildlife sanctuary where he lives. He then took a look in a couple vehicles before spotting a truck laden with bundles of sugar cane and cassava. Holding up an authoritative, the elephant then stopped the driver and proceeded to inspect the contents. Pulling down samples of its cargo, 
presumably to carry out a quality control exercise. After tasting some of the sugar cane, he then helped himself to a bit more before allowing the vehicles to then continue on their way. It seems as though this elephant has figured out quite an effective personal snack delivery service. Perhaps the highway bandit should get himself a mask and a nice pointy hat as well. Number 8. Woman films two giant wolves running alongside her car on highway. Not an average morning commute. Rhonda Miller would be driving to work in Canada's Northwest Territories, when she had this remarkable encounter on the road. She then managed to film the extraordinary side of two giant wolves running at full speed alongside of the snowy road. These majestic animals are racing along at a great pace when Miller spots them. So, she then slows down and moves to the side in order to pass by safely, all the while managing to capture the extraordinary encounter on video. As she does drive past each wolf, they turn their head to see what's approaching, but then continue on their own journey unaffected. It's a beautiful thing to see these graceful wild animals in this free and powerful state Miller was also so moved by her experience that she shared it with the news, telling the reporter that it was pretty inspiring and, I should imagine, one of the more exciting journeys to work that she's ever had. Just look at the size of those things. Number 7. Bear breaks into car, but odors scream so much, it decides it's not worth it. No wonder this bear decided not to bother at all, that screaming is just too much. Staying in a remote cabin in Asheville, North Carolina, a group of friends had left their vehicle unlocked outside the property. When the owners of the Mercedes spotted a bear, walking intently towards the car, they then decided to voice their displeasure. The animal had barely any chance to open the car door, when all manner of hideous shrieking would be let loose from the people watching the scene unfold. The bear looks frankly rattled, and he's not sticking around to find out what kind of crazy creature's making such a racket. The bear legs it back into the trees, and presumably the car's owner remembers to keep the vehicle locked from then on. They can certainly think that Boy Scout training which kicked in and set their friend off on a noise-making mission. I don't know, but I feel a little bit sorry for the bear. I wonder if he's ever even been brave enough to venture back out of the woods since, because that was a hell of a noise, like a wailing banshee. Number 6. Kruger Lion Tries Opening Car Door Lions are actually pretty intelligent animals that's clear enough, but did you know that these guys have figured out how to open car doors as well? Kind of worrying for all of your safari fans out there. This inquisitive lion seems to be very interested in this particular car as a row of traffic weights at the Kruger National Park in South Africa. She's looking very intently at the car door, and it turns out that she's just figuring out if she can open it. No big deal, you know. What? From inside the safety of a car, most people do feel fairly confident that the lions and other massive predators that they might encounter in the park aren't an immediate danger to them. But I wonder just how many people are driving around with their car doors unlocked. I guess that all those tasty-looking humans driving throughout the park might look like easy prey. If only the lions could figure out how to get those wrappers off. And that's just what some of them are learning to do, and it's terrifying. It kind of makes sense if you think about it, though. Lions in a safari park are constantly observing human behavior and picking up a few ideas along the way makes you wonder what else they might be learning from you. Number 5. Bison Fight Halts Traffic on Yellowstone Road Bison, well, they are absolutely massive. These gigantic pieces can weigh a whopping 2,000 pounds. So if a couple of big fat male bison begin kicking it off in front of you, it can be quite a sight. Yellowstone Park in the United States is home to about 5,000 of these bison, and spotting a herd of these big animals lumbering across the landscapes, not really that unusual. However, seeing a fight break out between two rival males on the road, right in front of your vehicle, that's a little bit less common. These gargantuan creatures wall up each other with such force that one of them is literally lifted off the road and thrown to the ground on the opposite side. Um, as Basin are able to run at speeds of about 30 miles an hour, these hulking creatures get especially grouchy during mating season, and it's not really recommended that you get too close. Even being in a vehicle at this distance would likely do little good to protect you from the full force and hefty weight of a bison if it landed on your car. That's going to be a big crunch, and it's going to sting a little bit. Number 4. Police scramble to capture wild boar in Hong Kong This one's just another boring afternoon in downtown Hong Kong. The Hong Kong police found themselves in pursuit of a dangerous thug that was rampaging throughout the city's financial district. 
They ended up getting out all of their riot gear and bringing in half the precinct's worth of cops, all to just try to get this extremely angry, wild boar under control. The boar had apparently drawn attention to itself. Earlier in the day, by charging at a few unfortunate people and actually causing injuries to a couple of them, along with an elderly cyclist, a cop was also amongst the rampaging pig's victims. It takes a series of unsuccessful attempts by numerous police officers and animal control people to eventually get a hold of this. One hairy pig nets and cages are flying in every direction as the board just seems to know every evasive move in the book, and the feckless cops just blindingly chuck equipment in the animal's general direction. Ultimately though, animal control does win out, and the boar is then wrestled into a vehicle, no doubt to be sent to live on a lovely farm in the countryside, just like my pet kitten when I was six years old. Number 3. Riders Encounter with Angry Ram Looks like war's been declared between the dirt bikers and this one particularly angry ram in Nelson, New Zealand. The furious ram has had quite enough of these rude bikers intruding on his territory and polluting his peaceful forest with all that noise, and he's staging a one-sheet protest. He's getting quite the reputation for his efforts as well. Footage shows a biker traveling along forest path when the ram hears him approach and then decides that enough is enough because he steps right into the middle of the track barring the way. For a few moments, it's a classic standoff. The two opponents eye each other, waiting to see who will make the first move ready to outgun the other one. The ram takes his first charge toward the bike, knocking the rider down and leaving the offending vehicle on the ground. That's one to zero for the ram. It then becomes a sort of wrestling match. The biker seems to be trying to push the angry sheep back into the forest so he can carry on his ride, and the sheep is having none of it. And the battle just rages on. Eventually, a mate has reached and we await the next one. It seems as though the dirt bikers have now attached a camera to the ram. So, the footage has got even weirder as we now get a sheep eye view of the fight. Which side are you rooting for in this one? Number 2. A cheetah jumps into a tourist's car during a safari. In a genuine squeaky bum moment, this safari tourist got a little bit closer to the wildlife than was promised in the holiday brochures. While spending spring break in Africa on safari, Photographer Peter Heston captured some extraordinary images when the tour groups he was leading had a close encounter with some cheetahs in Tanzania's Serengeti. The tour had stopped for lunch near to a group of cheetahs, and as they were watching the animals, they realized that some of them were becoming rather interested in the vehicles, moving together directly towards the tourists. One of the cheetahs then actually jumped onto the hood of a vehicle, which the guides assured the group was pretty common, and as the big cats are looking for higher ground, they also surveyed the area around them, and what happened next was pretty unusual. Another cheetah then suddenly leaps through a window and into the back of the car. With his heart no doubt in his mouth, tourist Britton Hayes managed to stay still and keep calm while he had his picture taken with a very close-up cheetah. Those were definitely some exciting holiday snaps to take home and show his mother. Number 1. Massive Alligator Crosses Through Middle of Florida Intersection out for a casual afternoon stroll, this enormous alligator stops traffic on a busy intersection in Sefner, Florida. Alligators can pretty much wonder where they choose. There aren't really many people who are going to pick a fight with one of them, or even any extra eager cops who will write them up a ticket for jaywalking. So, this gator isn't the least bit interested in using the crosswalk. Even the fact that there's a whole lot of traffic tring along the intersection, it just keeps going on in its own direction at its own pace causing a whole lot of kerfuffle along the way. It did give a woman out with her dog, the heebie-jeebies, when the huge lumbering reptile seemingly changed course and began heading in their direction, setting the dog up barking as well. Perhaps all of that wolfing was just too much for the alligator though, because it seemed to change its mind and then head off and search for a quieter location. See you later, alligator. That was an adrenaline-fueled experience. Have you ever had a close encounter with a wild animal? And was it too close for comfort? Let me know all about it in the comments below. Be sure to check out the other cool stuff showing up on the screen, and I'll see you next time.